Come on then, Pete. Five things you love about football. I love the romance of a player coming from non-league or amateur football and then taking it to the big leagues. If you're good enough, you get to play. We've got uh, a better World Cup than you guys, 32 teams. Yours is like four or something like that, it's insane. And the trophy itself as well, the World Cup's well better than your World Cup. It's iconic, it's got ball on the top, it's fantastic. Uh, the shape of the ball as well. What could you do with a rugby ball? Someone throws you a rugby ball, you throw up and down. That's all you can do, it's ridiculous. Uh, and also, just how blooming awesome football is. What's so good about rugby? Five things. Players don't give you cliché post-match interviews. Mm -hmm. That's one. They're huge guys, but they'll shed a tear when they sing their national anthem. Right, they're probably sad about playing rugby because it's not <laughs> very good. Uh, no, it's because they know that playing for their country is the greatest honour any player can have. All right, three. Opposing fans will sit together in next to each other, share a drink and share their love of the game together. Right, one more. Um, short shorts. <laughs> Where did that come from? I don't know. If you work that hard in the gym on your legs, you might as well sh Oh, God, this getting worse. <laughs> you can't identify with those guys on the pitch. I can't identify rugby players. They look like people out of Game of Thrones are crying out loud. They're massive. One of the best things about being a fan is when you see a footballer who's just insanely talented and he does something incredible, a flourish, it makes the heart swell. Do you get that sort of thing with rugby? Is there something that unites the fans? Oh, completely. Well, I'd, I'd say it's much the same. I think we kind of have to come to some sort of agreement that rugby and football do have similarities. It's about sharing something beautiful. Passion. Passion. Camaraderie. Yeah. Pete, you've got to come to a rugby game. I'll take you to your first game. All right, fine. If I'm free, book the next day off work. <laughs> now I'm worried. Uh, but if I come to a rugby game, you have to come to a football game. I'll come watch 22 millionaires kick a pig's bladder about for a bit. Sounds like a plan.